You can now create custom form tools. Here you can see a design that I've created and here you can see a vector that I've created. Now this is one half of a custom form tool. The custom form tools are located within the toolpath operations and this allows you to edit a tool. As you can see in the middle, gives you a preview of what the tool is going to look like. On the left, you can enter a description, tool number for example. On the right, you can enter all the parameters for the tool, including the step down and the step over. And this will then be added to the tool database and it will be on the left hand side. You can also add a new group to this and then just drag and drop the tool into the new group. When you're happy with this, you can process your tool paths and then you can simulate them. This will cut the part using your custom form tool, as you can see here.